I have unfortunate but breaking news. It's unfortunate that this title isn't clickbait. The infamous game Skyblock, which focuses on expanding your plot through farming, mining, and other ventures on Roblox, has been content deleted. This is insane news and reminds us all of a situation like Pokemon Brick Bronze. The developers of Skyblock, EZ.GG, have issued multiple notices on this. They claim they have had a back and forth battle with Roblox and something known as DMCA, which is copyright law. The Discord server is in fury, it's all a mess. According to the developers, this has been going on for weeks, and the deletion of the game might even last for weeks. It was first noticed yesterday when the developers tweeted out this notice. Unfortunately, after a discussion with at Roblox regarding a DMCA request, we have been forced to change our name to Islands. Keeping our old name could lead to our game being shut down for a few weeks. Our top priority is staying online. Thanks for your continued support. So, what's going to happen further? Could the game stay deleted for a very long time, or forever? Let's find out. My name's Snooky Alex, and this is our Roblox news series, which we summarize news stories and find the majority opinion. Let's get started. Yo, what's up, Hashtag Nerd Squad, and welcome back to another video. Before we get started in this video, don't forget to subscribe for this little box drama, news, tips and tricks, and more. Don't forget to turn on the bell so that you never miss out on one of my videos, which are usually uploaded weekly to twice a week. In order to get into the subject fairly and easier to follow, we are going to do organization. This video will be split into sections, so if you want to go to a certain timestamp, you can go in the description or simply just skip to it using the new video chapters feature. In today's video, we will be going through Number 1. Skyblock's tweets and what happened and what's going on Number 2. Interviews with Skyblock players and the community opinion Number 3. Our conclusion Let's get started with our first point, which is Skyblock's tweets Around 19 hours before making this video, 11.17pm on July 13th, 2020, Roblox Islands, formerly known as Skyblock Roblox, tweeted, Unfortunately, after a discussion with at Roblox regarding a DMCA request, we've been forced to change our name back to Islands. Keeping our old name could lead to our game being shut down for a few weeks. Our top priority is staying online. Thank you for your continued support. The emoji is a smiling face with an open mouth and cold sweat. Now you may be wondering, what is a DMCA request? Let's learn. A DMCA takedown refers to a notice sent by a copyright owner because they believe someone has posted an infringement and they want it removed without the hassle of filing an infringement lawsuit. It is sanctioned under the Digital Millennium Copyright Act, which does stand for DMCA. The copyright owner typically notifies the web provider, which in this case, it was Roblox that hosts the site, which is the ISP. The ISP, assuming they're not in China or some other country where the locals don't really fear US copyright lawyers, typically removes whatever is complained about. For example, an infringing picture at a blog, a movie at YouTube, or etc. By expeditionally removing the infringing content, the ISP is therefore given a safe harbor, meaning the ISP cannot be ensued for infringement. Therefore, a DMCA takedown is used to aggressively take down content if someone copyrights or violate the copyright law. This tweet did spark a lot of confusion from players as to why Skyblock was being given a DMCA takedown, with some using the argument that Skyblock shouldn't be taken down because it is simply taking an idea. However, the tweet referenced that the name Skyblock is copyrighted indeed. At this point, the game wasn't taken quite down yet. However, that tweet was met with some responses that felt the new name was distasteful and honestly quite a sudden and odd change. Let's take a look at some of them. This user says, Maybe Skylands would sound better, but you don't need to follow this game. I haven't been in touch with Skyblock now since I'm pretty much retired and don't play it anymore. Hopefully they don't shut down your game for the people who worked hard for their islands. Anyways, bye. Well, we all know that didn't really age well. Some others suggested names with Sky in them. However, most people weren't worried about this because it was simply a name change, right? However, that was about to change. Then around 1.30p p.m. today, Ro at Roblox Islands tweeted this. At Roblox, just shut down the game. We're working our hardest to get everything back online. Your progress will not be lost. 
press F to pay respects. Now this is where the game was hit with an actual DMCA notice. If you try to go to the game right now, from their profile, it is literally impossible to access. Private service with friends? Doesn't work. There are absurd theories as to why it got taken down today and not just the name. Keep in mind that these are rumors, so do not believe them unless evidence is confirmed. One crazy one offers the idea that Roblox Skyblock has been in a lawsuit for a while, for around 500,000 US dollars. This theory argues that because the game has made quite a bit of money, after Kaneko Kitten shouted out the game in his video, and it also made a prediction that it would get popular. Others argue it was too similar to Minecraft Skyblock, which is where the general idea originated. Roblox Skyblock takes ideas and more and rests from the Minecraft game, which they are basically both the same game, just on two different platforms. However, there is key noticeable differences in both platforms. Plus, an idea cannot be copyrighted. However, the game name and the rest can be. I've tried searching up this and I've had no luck with copyrighting the US database or the Canada base, which is where the lead developer of Hypixel lives. Most people estimate it is Minecraft Hypixel that owns the trademark. The Discord left this message that is now being spammed in an effort to control the chaos that is ensuing from these theories, and a bit of, um, other spamming people and going crazy? Hey y'all, when the game comes back on Roblox, your progress won't be removed. Nothing will change, the devs just need to get legal issues fixed in order for the game to be added again. Updates will be posted, so if you want to keep up on everything going on, go to the actual Twitter owned by the devs. False information is being spread in reference to the rumors. Don't trust anything that is sent unless it is from the staff team here, please. Due to all the scam, Dino is being overworked and we can't manually moderate because all the commands are not going through. Until the issue is over and the spam comes down, we can't do anything. Staff do not control the soul mode, nor can we lock channels. With all this being said so far, please do not raid the Roblox Discord server or any other server like Minecraft. They cannot bring back the game, nor are they the reason why the game was taken down. It isn't a right to spam other servers for our issues, and it's also against Discord terms of service. We appreciate all the support, but don't go spreading hate to others. This leads us to now. Therefore, that theory where they say Minecraft cannot bring it back up, and it is not the reason why the game was taken down, shuts down most of these theories. This leads us to now, where we are in the present. Let's lead. Let's read some community tweets on the situation. This one by Luanvo says, Stupid Roof by Robux IMO. A lot of players have spent time on that game and all of a sudden it gets shut down. All I see from this outcome is that it's going to end up like Pokemon Brick Bronze all over again. Won't be surprised if a lot of players end up quitting Roblox. Jumpy Mudkip says, I feel like I have to bring this up since people have been blaming Roblox for shutting it down or even the developer team. Right from the start, everyone should have acknowledged the fact that this game is obviously heavily inspired by Microsoft's Minecraft and its sub-server Hypixel. The dev team really tried hard to differentiate the two games in hopes of avoiding legal action being taken by Microsoft themselves, but unfortunately there must have been some complications along the way, which I presume it was the reason why the game shut down. I spend maybe 5 hours a day on this game. It's been a wonderful way to pass my time. Really hope this gets fixed and my wonderful island isn't corrupted. Okay, off topic here, but that actually is a really nice island. It's just called Islands now, why would they shut it down? The entire Forsaken game was deleted. No one technically owns the rights to Skyblock, and even when you change your name, still seeing this level of complete ignorance on Roblox's part is disgusting. Fix your copyright rules, Roblox. Here's my last and final conclusion on the subject. Personally, me, I really like to play the game a lot, especially on Roblox. I invested, I think, a good 40 hours into the game, and I'm sad to see it go, but I do see why there would be a DMCA takedown. However, you cannot copyright an idea just as they said, so it's probably an unknown reason that most of us do not know. We can make theories, but to be honest, it's just like Dr. Disrespect, where we actually have to find out the cause of the DMCA takedown, whether that be stemming from the game, the music, the slimes, etc. Thank you very much for watching my video. 
I'd appreciate if you subscribe if you'd made it this far. These videos take a lot of effort to make, and that's why I only upload once a week. I'll see you all in the next video. Hopefully Skyblock does get up.